Hi Stranglers fans, hi Rare Vinyl Collectors, hi Punk fans. Um, I'm going to show you today this. The Stranglers 5 minutes. Why am I showing you this um, as it's just a standard release? Or is it? Actually no, this is the, what I found to be the uber rare um, EMI Records pressing. Now, I don't think the, the camera is going to pick that up, so I'm going to drop a, um, a standalone picture of it right here. You see how it says, <laughs> let me read it now, uh, manufactured in the UK by EMI Records Limited. Um, that appears on a very limited amount of pressings. The general standard is ma manufactured in the UK by United Artists Records. Um, I contacted almost 60 people on a very well-known selling site that isn't eBay. Um, uh, and they'd all listed it as the EMI variant. Every single one, every single listing was listed incorrectly. They listed it actually as the EMI, EMI variant, but it was really just the standard issue, which they were actually selling. So, uh, much apologies. One was particularly rude and asked me to stop bothering him as I was asking him to check uh, that what he was listing was the actual item. Uh, but he wanted me to pay first and um, leave it at that. And I said, no, no, please check. You check. If it's correct, I'll pay. And he basically said, you know, stop bothering me. So I said, uh, or I wrote rather, you know, I'm trying to give you money here. You know, do you treat all your potential buyers like this? So, um, um, yeah, I'm going to name them. I'm going to name and shame. On Discogs, they're called House of Tracks. All one word. Um, avoid. They do not want to check their stock or deal in a polite manner to potential buyers. But that's another story, isn't it? So yeah, I finally tracked this down on the Stranglers memorabilia site by a wonderful guy called, by the name of Mark Hodgson. And he sold it to me for a very reasonable price. Uh, I, I wouldn't have thought this would have been so difficult to get hold of, but uh, there you go. To all intents and purposes, I mean, I know this is in a, a non-picture sleeve, but uh, you, you know, you can't get hold of it. As I found, 60 sellers, all wrong, nothing on eBay. But uh, one decent Stranglers fan had it and wanted to part with it. So yeah, glad to add that to my collection. Thanks for watching this um, sub four minute video. Um, what a strange journey this is becoming. Uh, yeah, so more stuff on the way. I'll see you on the next video. Bye for now.